start having a kind of a special airport uh, for us in all member states. So that, that will cater uh, you know, for us to facilitate the movement, mobility of the people, uh, connecting business to business uh, contact. Uh, and trying to bring closer <coughs> the different member states from different uh, continents uh, so that there will be more connection uh, and closer relation between uh, one another, member state, and promoting tourism, of course, travelers in particular. And uh, with a view also that one day we can have a kind of a special air link between all member states. So these are all in our mind because uh, we have signed a visa agreement, but it is yet to be implemented. So we are providing this kind of a uh, kind of a practical uh, proposal so that uh, we can implement all those visa agreements so that we will feel that we are close to one another. And uh, I'm happy that uh, last year we were able to sign the letter of intent with the uh, Sabiha Gojian International Airport, mm -hmm. uh, where that is the first airport to be uh, termed as the DA designated airport. And what they will provide in that is that they will start uh, uh, having a special fast track lane for the citizen of D8 member state. And then uh, we will have a special lounge, for example. We, they will start promoting uh, D8 activities uh, to publicize member state uh, at the airport, in their magazine, and things like that. Uh, they will offer us facility also for us to use for uh, a special travel fair or expos at, at the airport itself. And I'm happy to inform that when I went to uh, Abuja last year, the Minister of Civil Aviation of Nigeria agreed already to provide uh, the Abuja airport called Nakumu, yeah? Nakumu International Airport in Abuja. Last year, uh, Honorable President uh, Edouan mentioned something about, you know, member state must start looking into using local currencies and they came to us they say we have a proposal and this is a company fintech company from malaysia so they introduced to us uh, a kind of uh, initiative uh, of what they call a d8 uh, uh, payment card d8p card they call it and this d8p card uh, will be <coughs> quite unique because the transaction will use local currencies for the first time so we are looking at that possibility and they are now talking to all the central banks of member state. So they have visited a uh, few uh, member states and had a serious discussion with the central bank of all member states. And uh, I'm happy to say that I think uh, many have uh, given their positive response. Mm -hmm. So they will be 